There are times you may want to do unique cuts or clips into an object. Next to the markers button is the cutting clipping shape menu. The first thing you need to do is turn on the cutting or clipping shape. This will be a light blue frame of the shape. Going back to the menu, you can choose from five different shapes. Feel free to experiment. Once you have your shape, you need to choose either cutting or clipping. Cutting will cause any material in the shape to be taken away, and clipping does the opposite and removes everything but what's inside the shape. I will click cutting for the time being. As you may notice, your cutting or clipping shape may not even be touching your object. To fix this, hold ALT and left mouse click to translate the cutting shape. Keep in mind you may have to do a regular rotation of your object and then keep readjusting the cutting and clipping shape to your desired location. If you decide you want to do clipping instead, go back to the menu and change the selection. Now only the object that is inside the box remains. Those are the basics and feel free to try out the different cutting and clipping shapes. Be sure to take a look at our next video on adding annotations.